Oh yeah, baby. I haven't done a video in a while, so I might as well do one again. <laughs> just a little update video. And yeah, I just came back from the Niagara Video Game Swap. You know, <laughs> player guide he put on there, awesome event. And I figured I'll show you some of the stuff that I got. But first, yeah, I got this in the mail recently. Uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. I've been watching a lot of his videos for a while, and <laughs> yeah, this is Roger E. Blair, or yeah, Roger E. Blair the Bird. So <laughs> very cool name to have. And no, this isn't Todd Rogers. No, this is another famous Twin Galaxy, you know, player. So. He has like a lot of Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis, World Records. That he's one of the top 10 players on there. And yeah, he was nice enough to send me one of his cards. So he just got a card recently. He's all excited and yeah, he even signed it for me. Gave me a little thank you note and everything and that's pretty cool. I'm hoping one of these days, you know, <laughs> I'll get a card myself, you know, being the Bronze Venture World Champion on TurboGrafx 16, PC Engine World Records. But <laughs> again, it's TurboGrafx 16, so I don't really get the limelight that, <laughs> you know, other players would. I'm going to be like no Billy Mitchell or not. But hey, I'm trying and I submitted some other world records. Like I just submitted one for Star Soldier Banish and Nerf. You know, because I'm the Star Soldier after all. And now I'm hoping to get a world record on Star Soldier Bash and Earth. <laughs> I love this game. Such an underrated classic for the N64. And, you know, a lot of people trash the N64, and rightfully so, but <laughs> at least it does have a few gems on there for the system. Yeah, not, not only got a couple new world records, well hopefully new world records. It still needs to get approved and all that. In the two and five minute modes. But <laughs> yeah. I got this over at James you know, booth at the Vorn on the Market. Yeah, Tetris Spear. Complete in bots. And I'm hoping to get some world records on many of these, you know, modes here. <laughs> Rescue, hide and seek, time trials, yeah. I'm hoping to get world records on all of these modes. And <laughs> Tetris Spear, I believe, is their underrated gem for the N64. Because not only is it made by a cool Canadian company and some crazy developers that <laughs> leave notes in the game's Rones file themselves. <laughs> but yeah, the game is so much fun. It's like a 3D Tetris game done right. You know. And believe me, they can do 3D Tetris very, very wrong. <laughs> I'm looking at you, block out. <laughs> but yeah, and 3D Tetris sort of virtual boy. But this one is probably the best example of a 3D Tetris up there. And yeah, I'm hoping to get world records on those ones too, hopefully. Yeah, it's still an adjudication. But, anyways, let me get back to the Niagara Video Game Swap and all the games I got at the show. Well, I didn't get the, you know, too many this year because Monday's tight and <laughs> yeah. I don't think people are buying too many games as of late, so it's been slow at the 400 market and some of the swaps as of late, so. I've only been able to get a few games, but I still got a few good ones like Captain America here, nice and complete. I already have this game complete myself, but this one is in better shape than the one I currently have up there. <laughs> Sadly, this one doesn't have like the collector's pin. I want the pin, you know, one of these days. <laughs> oh, but this is still in very good shape. I like that. Okay, Tetris Attack, and they're a good version of Tetris out there. Okay, I have Marvels. Yeah. Marvel vs. Capcom 3 with actual Marvel characters in it, you know. Has Wolverine in it. <laughs> this is before they actually take characters like Wolverine out. I said, why? <laughs> Leave Wolverine in there. Yeah, Spider-Man's in here too. The Hulk. Deadpool. Lots of cool characters. Uh, Morgan? Yeah, from Darkstalkers. Yeah. 
it's hard to believe, uh, yeah, there's a lot of cool characters in here. <laughs> Unlike, you know, the newer Marvel vs. Capcom games. Yeah. Flair's Guide, he's the one who held up in Niagara. No offense again for giving me your card, dude. Yeah, I got Burning Force here. I got that over at Bobby's Table, I think. I think, yeah, it was Bobby's Table. But, okay. I got, yeah, Skyward Sword. Punch out. Okay. Yeah, Scooby Doo. SpongeBob. <laughs> SpongeBob the movie on PlayStation 2. <laughs> Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Oh, I know this one's gonna be bad, but <laughs> I know some people like the movie because of Johnny Depp. Yeah. I got a Boo character. Yep. Nice cool coaster here. Yeah. I got, yeah, our type I was surprised. This one was nice and cheap. I said, are you sure you're selling this for that cheap? And said, yep, all right, I'll do it. <laughs> uh, this one wasn't as cheap, though. <laughs> yeah. Arcade card for a turbo PC engine tool. Yeah, this arcade card is like, uh, I think, 16 megs of memory. So, it really makes the games look super special. At least, you know, arcade-based dual games. So you got like World Heroes 2, uh, Art of Fighting, and I think uh, Fatal Fury Special is on the Super CD and they look incredible if you had that card. <laughs> it's hard to explain. Uh, Crystallis. Yeah, very cool RPG on the original Nintendo. Doesn't get much love, but it's a great game. Yeah. Okay, I got Rally Bike here. Very cool overhead racer on the original Nintendo. And kind of a tough game to find. So, it was nice to get that one cheap. Okay. Castlevania. Yeah, the original. Definitely a hard game to find as a late. Even though it's a arcade classic. Okay, speaking of classic, here is the original Mega Man with that crazy artwork. <laughs> oh man, I love that. Hopefully that will be the thumbnail for this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> How does this person live? <laughs> looks like he has a bad back. He looks like he's in his mid-50s. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Star Soldier. You know I gotta love that one. <laughs> yeah, I recently got a world record on this one. I think I'm second place in the world at Star Soldier. So, that's kinda cool. And yeah, I'm first place in the world on the Power Region Edition. So, yeah, I got that game in the next room. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get too much, so this is gonna be a short video. Got a PlayStation 2 controller, why not? <laughs> Yeah, I got Chrome Cross here at Jason's table. Yeah, I'm glad to hear that his dad is doing better. And yeah, I got the new Tetris here. Uh, not the best Tetris, but yeah, it's still fun. And it's made by the same people who did Tetris Spear there, so can't complain too much. So yeah, that's all I got. And usually I get a lot more, but <laughs> again, money's tight and. I gotta sell some more stuff, but we did okay at the show. I don't want to rag on too much because it was so cool seeing everybody. Well worth the trip, but <laughs> the problem is, yeah, it's about two and a half hours again there and back, and we got lost a few times. And my friends Jason and Randy were fighting with one another, saying, No, you're supposed to go here, or you're supposed to go there, and Jason. <laughs> Uh, was getting confused by GPS saying, oh no, don't turn here. And then he rose, realized, okay, you were supposed to turn there, but <laughs> oh, it was just nuts. I hate driving, <laughs> especially in rainy conditions. And we were all super tired, super grumpy. <laughs> and we were just fighting at the whole show. <laughs> and uh, yeah, and I was kind of egging them on, saying, you gonna talk to him like that, or... 
Come on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you guys are such shirts. I heard just egging on the fight. <laughs> Said, ah, oh. it was just a crazy day. Everybody's grumpy, unhappy, tired, sore. <laughs> yeah, we're not kids anymore. It's this is getting harder and harder, but <laughs> it's just so worth it, you know, to get some of these games. You know, talk to other gamers out there and find certain deals and. <laughs> just shoot the shit with people <laughs> uh, yeah I got a lot of good stuff here even though it's not a lot of gains like I remember like in like 40 or 50 gains at some of these other events you know that I'm going to and and there's gonna be more swaps so I gotta even it out I can't spend my money all at once because this is just the start of many swaps that I'm going go through before you know the holiday season because next week I'm going to Durham and then a couple weeks after that we're going to a Milton show and then yeah I'm gonna see if I can head down to a Toronto show held by Steven yeah I think on December 8th so there's gonna be a lot of swaps so I may I might be making more crazy videos in the future so I don't know, kind of look forward to that. <laughs> it's just me talking about games I have, so. Yeah, but at least, yeah, I got some good games. Who doesn't love that cover artwork? <laughs> yeah, amazing game. I can't believe there's like no sequel to this. I know it's a sequel to Corona Trigger, so that one is Chrono Cross. I don't know what the next one's gonna be. I, Corona Awesome, <laughs> but I don't know, just make another Corona game. Get off your lazy butts and do something about it. Come on, I demand it. As your Star Soldier Mansion Nerf World Champion, I demand a Corona sequel. Give it to me now, I want it. <laughs> uh, so that's why I'm so freaking tired today. <laughs> I didn't make a video right away after the show because yeah, I'm that zonked out. <laughs> I think, uh, yeah, as soon as I dropped off Jason and Randy, they both went to sleep. And then when I finally went home, <laughs> yeah, I was all, you know, zonked out too. I was all tired. And now that I woke up here, now that I'm fully woken up, <laughs> I decided to make a video. And, yeah, you know, <laughs> I'm busy doing my editor jobs over at the casino and over at the 400 market running in that booth and you know i went out with my girlfriend the other night we saw daltrey over at the casino <laughs> yeah it was a fun night you know, seeing them <laughs> play all their hits and seeing them play purple rain at the end so yeah that was so awesome and <laughs> i'm tired but it's a good kind of tired because i felt like i got a lot of stuff done Games, games, more games. <laughs> I still got a little bit of money left for the Durham show, which is next week. I think uh, November 3rd. I could be wrong. <laughs> next Sunday, next Sunday. So I'll figure it out. <laughs> right now, I'm just going to get some more sleep. And I thank you all out there for watching. Yeah. <laughs> Sign up for my Patreon. It's just a dollar a month, you know. I'm not gonna force you or anything or twist your arm, but <laughs> uh, I'll be able to quit my jobs and be able to get much more sleep if you guys can help me out. Yeah, no pressure though. I'm not gonna you know, force you or nothing. <laughs> but, anyways, yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy the stuff that I have right now. Yeah, hopefully, I can get some world records soon, please. <laughs> and, yeah. You know, talk to other world champions out there. And hopefully one day get my own card. Uh, yeah, that's just a little recap of the crazy stuff that I do in SLA. <laughs> uh, but yeah, when you're a gamer, uh, it's good kind of crazy. <laughs> I'd say best hobby in the world is being a gamer. Okay, and that's it for me. 
This is the one and only Star Soldier 1, baby. Over and out. Woo!